Hello everyone and today we will discuss about the calculations in local anesthetic. So let's get started with that. So first we have to know what is the maximum dose of lignocaine in a healthy patient without adrenaline or epinephrine. It is 4.4 milligrams per kg and in Cases with adrenaline, this dose will be increased to 7.0 milligrams per kg. Now, what we mean when we say 2% of lignocaine? So, 2% of lignocaine, it means 2 grams of lignocaine in 100 ml. Of solution right and this means that there is 2000 milligrams in 100 ml of solution that means that there is 20 milligrams of lignocaine in 1 ml of solution by unitary method. So now what will be the amount of lignocaine contained in one cartridge? So one cartridge is having a volume of 1.8 ml. That is the ideal volume of one cartridge. So 20 milligram of lignocaine is contained in one ml of solution. So 1.8 ml will contain 20 into 1.8 ml that is in one cartridge which is equal to 36 milligram of lignocaine in one cartridge. Right. So one cartridge will contain 36 milligram of lignocaine solution. The maximum dose is 2%. In cases without adrenaline, it is 4.4 milligram per kg. So for a 70 kg adult, it will be 4.4 into 70 which is equal to approximately 308 mg, right? So this is the maximum dose that can be administered in a 70 kg adult without adrenaline. And how many cartridges can be given in a 70 kg adult? It is, so one cartridge is containing 36 mg and we have to give maximum 308 milligrams of lignocaine so by simple maths it is 308 divided by 36 it will amount to around 8.5 cartridge so this we can give without any risk to the patient so in cases with adrenaline we will have 7.0 milligrams that can be administered per kg. So in cases of patient or an individual with 70 kg adult, we can give 7 into 70, that is 490 milligrams. And the number of cartridges that can be used is one cartridge is having 36 milligram of lignocaine. So 490 milligram of lignocaine will be contained in 13.6 cartridges. Now calculating epinephrine. To know the maximum doses that we can give in a healthy patient and in patient with heart disease. So in a concentration of 1 is to 50,000 
in healthy patient it can be given maximum dose is 0.2 mg and in a heart disease patient it is 0.04 mg similarly in a concentration of 1 lakh or 100000 the concentration that can be given for healthy patient is 0.2 mg and in heart disease patient it is 0.04 mg now the concentration of epinephrine in milligrams present in each of this concentration for one is to fifty thousand concentration there will be 0 0.036 milligrams will be present then in one is to hundred thousand it will be 0 0.018 milligrams and similarly in concentration of 2 lakh it will be 0 0.009 milligrams from this we get to know that in a concentration of 1 is to 2 lakhs the concentration of epinephrine we have is 0 0.009 milligrams so this is having a concentration of 0 0.009 milligrams so in 1 is to 2 lakh concentration we have 0 0.009 milligram concentration of epinephrine and the maximum dose that can be given in a healthy patient is 0.2 milligram so the number of capsules that can be delivered in a healthy patient is number of caps that can be given in one healthy patient is 0.2 milligram divided by 0 0.009 milligrams and that will be equivalent to 22.22 caps so these many number of capsules we can administer in a healthy patient in healthy patient the number of cartridges that can be administered depends on maximum dose of local anesthetic aid in heart disease patient the number of cartridges that has to be administered it depends on the maximum dose of epinephrine so that was it about the calculations that are considered in local anesthetics i hope you understood it well and until we meet next bye bye till then